Hi, I watched some dog training videos and because the approach there was very different from my own so I will try to show some basics of my own approach. I work with the attention of the dog and here the dog is quite friendly and only half attentive because it is kind of fi trying to figure out whether it should sit or lay down, but it's not considering any middlemost option of not kind of not sitting or no laying, but something in between. So it's not so reactive like it should be in agility or something, some other things like that. And some basic forms of attention you get like this if you the dog shuts away its attention from somewhere or if it's quite friendly and likes something like if it gets tippy so it's rounded not stiff at all so these are good to notice because if the dog is stiff somewhere then it is not going as far to that direction as it could and then you don't get the most out of the dog and if the dog is with an open attention, like here, so it tries it best. And it should have lively eyes here. He is not having lively eyes, but kind of bored. Not so attentive. And, yeah. Okay. This is the basic part of it. The other part is that you have the lively attention, then you get the dog's own brains to work, because the dog should always be told what it's wanted from it, so it can use its own understanding, and you should always watch where the dog is watching and listening to, so that you know what's its sphere of attention and what it's going to do. each moment, each place, kind of, you know what's possible for it and what not. Thank you.